it's horrible. You can't see in front of your face. Chip Creel talking about a scary moment while driving up north. He says while he was driving on 75 from Flint to the UP, he fell victim to a winter whiteout. It's just, uh, you can almost lose your direction because you don't know which way, you know, the traffic is going. If it's not for the lights, then you don't know which way to go. It, it, it gets pretty bad on the highway. So what would you do if you suddenly drove into a whiteout? How would you react? Creel has some advice to save you if visibility is next to zero. Oh, just, just stay on the road. Try to stay as close to the edge of the road uh, without hitting the little uh, things that make the sounds. I'm not even sure what they call, but, you know, stay close as those as you can. And you make it. Sergeant Rick Jones with the Michigan State Police says there are things you can do to save lives if conditions deteriorate quickly. What we recommend is you slowing down or stopping, depending on how bad it is, obviously. Um, not tailgating people, making sure your windows stay clear. Um, that that's what causes people to wind up crashing their car. Jones adds in a blizzard, don't be afraid to pull over and wait until you can see again. He says use your low beams and if necessary, turn on your hazard lights for added protection. And Jones says there are consequences to anyone caught driving recklessly in a whiteout. They can get uh, driving too fast for conditions tickets. Um, they can get that. They can get uh, reckless driving, careless driving, depends on what happens on it. Creel says from now on when driving, he always expects the unexpected. It's Michigan. <laughs> Be prepared. Reporting in Genesee County, Rachel McCreary, WNEM TV5.